Hey, what's up everyone? So today I'm gonna teach you a super nostalgic Chinese dish that might be difficult to find in New York City's Chinatown or other Chinatowns across the US. Today I am making a Watan Ha Fan. The closest translation that I can think up of is smooth egg. But don't worry about it, I know it sounds weird, but it's actually an egg-based sauce. It's closely related to lobster sauce. And this egg sauce, you can put it on basically anything, noodles, vegetables, and you can add all types of proteins, beef, chicken, and in this case, shrimp. So here are all the ingredients that I need. As you can see, it's not much. I'll put the ingredients and the recipe in the description box below. So right here, I've got 150 grams of shrimp. This is about 10 pieces of shrimp. So these are pretty big size. It is already shelled and deveined. And I'm just gonna cook the shrimp in simmering water. I'm just gonna cook it until it's 70% done because I'm gonna finish cooking it along with the rest of the ingredients. Now doing that is a very important step because shrimp is notoriously easy to overcook. Okay, so the other ingredients, garlic and spring onions. Just gonna slice up the garlic. Just like that. And then we just chop up the spring onions. Spring onions go in the end. Making this type of recipe video has put me in touch with a lot of people who've had this recipe before when they were kids. And that is why I like making this type of recipe. So we just set these aside. All right, and now we need to prepare two eggs. And these are large size eggs, by the way. And just beat it up. That's it. And then the most important thing of all in this recipe, this is one tablespoon of corn flour or cornstarch. Combine it with a tablespoon of water. We have to make a slurry. A slurry is a sauce thickener and just mix it really well. The corn flour doesn't really dissolve and you will have to mix it again before you drop it into your pan because the corn flour will settle right in the bottom of the bowl. And that's it for all the prep work. Let's get cooking. So heat your pan on a medium heat. When the wok starts to smoke, add a tablespoon of oil. Spread it around. Drop in the garlic. We're gonna cook the garlic for just about 10 seconds. Enough time to release all the flavors into the oil. Then we add half a cup of water. And we add the seasonings, a tablespoon, of oyster sauce, half a teaspoon of sugar, quarter teaspoon salt. Mix it up. And when the sauce is boiling like that, give your slurry a final mix and drop it right into the pan. You're gonna immediately see the sauce thicken up. Switch your fire on to a medium low heat. Get your eggs ready. This is where the magic happens. Just slowly drop it in to the pan and just slowly drop it all in. And just let the eggs sit for about 10 to 15 seconds. Drop in the shrimp and just start mixing it. Hey, check that out. It looks awesome, right? And then finally, just throw in the spring onions. So we're just gonna cook that for five more seconds on a very low heat, just to make sure that the shrimp is cooked through. Now, this is a very important step. Don't trust this idiot to tell you what tastes good or not. Taste that sauce. If it needs to be a little bit more salty, add some more oyster sauce or a little bit of salt, but add a little bit at a time, taste it until it's just right for you. Traditionally, this sauce is served over rice but you can most certainly serve it over noodles. I like to top it off with some ground white pepper and just a little bit more fresh spring onions. So as you can see, smooth egg sauce is a very, very versatile sauce that you can put over basically anything and just make yourself a quick and authentic Chinese meal. So I hope you all try this out. And remember, as always, I do make deliveries. I take Bitcoins and camels as payment. So I'll see you all next time.